Troubleshoot your hijacked web browser part 1, for Chromies, please try the below content one. Assure your Google Chrome is current. To do this, try updating your Chrome first. Having trouble doing so? See this help page at https slash slash gu.gl slash eu and make sure Chrome related services have been set to run manually or automatically. Two other basic steps are listed as below, restore homepage slash start page. Clear cache and cookies can be useful. Check Chrome slash slash extension slash, for newbies, we suggest you scan for browser hijackers using a trustworthy antivirus solution, and clean up any other unknown items. If you can't remove some stubborn app, run Chrome Policy Remover. For power users, navigate to c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash group policy backslash machine, or c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash group policy backslash user right parenthesis and remove the file named registry.pol. Download, install, and update Malwarebytes Anti-Malware, the free version and the build that works for your system slash device, so you can detect and erase hidden pups in your system. Run Norton Power Eraser, NPE. Note that, if NPE does not remove the unwanted toolbars, then manually remove them by using the add slash remove programs or uninstall a program in the control panel. Run Chrome Cleanup Tool Cre a new user profile on your Chrome. For Mac users, see detailed steps below. Optionally, create a new user profile on your computer, Windows.
completely remove the ruined Chrome, restart when the uninstallation is complete. Then, download and install Chrome Canary. Try turning off the pop-up setting in Chrome. Give the reset browser settings button a go. Additionally, You may need to uninstall some, disabled and unused slash unknown, add-ons manually, later. Four. Back up your personal data, then restore slash reset and slash or reinstall, perform a clean install of, Windows. Steps to create new Chrome profile, for Mac quit Google Chrome completely. In the Mac menu bar at the top of the screen, click Go. Select Go to folder. Enter the following directories, 
slash library slash application support slash google slash chrome slash in the text field, then press go. Locate the folder called default in the directory window that opens and rename it as backup default. Try opening google chrome again. A new default folder is automatically created as you start using the browser. How to reset the host's file back to the default. Copy the following text, and then paste the text into the file. Replace the old host's file, which is located percent win dir percent backslash system32 backslash drivers backslash etc.